Hi, my name is Chuck Polidori and I'm from Lightyear Music and I'm going to show you how to hook up the entire system now. We've done three different parts. We did the speaker hookup, we did the video hookup, and we did the player uh, amplifier. Now I'm going to do all three. This top piece is the cordless microphone. Um, this does plug into the first mic jack. Uh, this would be an option that your system may or may not have, but if you do, your mic jack plugs into here. But let's get down to the, um, the um, basic uh, setup here. To hook up the amplifier to the player, you must make sure that you're an input VCD DVD for this demonstration. VCD to CD. It does have other inputs, so if you select a different input when you plug in the player into the back of the amp, it's got to match the input VCD CD. I'll show you that when we get to the back, but in this case, we're on VCD CD. You adjust the input. Next. Speaker A and B. Speakers A and B, for this demonstration, I'm going to select Speaker A. Okay? That's Speaker B, Speaker A, B, and Speaker A. I selected Speaker A for this demonstration because I'm going to use the top two terminals for this demonstration. That's all you need to hook up in the front. To set this up, that's the only thing. Normally, it comes standard when it comes out of the box that way. Also, you know, you have to have your master volume up and you have to have your mic volume set a little bit up. Okay, and then you, of course you have your treble on your bass, but that doesn't have to have any effect on this hooking up this to here. That's all this demonstration is. Okay, let's go around the back of the system. So, now we're going to hook up the player to the amplifier, okay? So, we'll plug in uh, the audio left and audio right. I'm going to go red and white. Now sometimes this would be a three-part cable with a yellow video, so that's possible. I'm just making this as simple as I can for the demonstration. Red and white, red and white. Now I selected VCD and CD input on the front when I selected. If you remember that, I'm going to now put the red in the red and the white in the white. Okay, that was the system now because I had it already running for you. And I'm going to show you the, I'm going to just shove those back out of the way right here. So remember the player, left and right, don't use these terminals, use these two and these two and you'll be perfect. Now, for the speaker hookup, okay, I'm going to show you a, a, a couple different things. Let me turn down my volume for a second here. And I'm going to give you a couple different options when I hook this in. Now you might have bought a regular speaker like this with uh, no LED lights in the front or you got the one with the LED light panel here. If you got the one with the LED hookup, you'll be using these bare wires and they have to go down here. So you'll have a bare wire, we solder the test for you, make it real easy. All you do is push this into red, you push this into black. And then make sure they're tight in there, you're good to go. And then you take the other end of the cable, which looks like this, it's a very simple terminal. And remember I select speaker A on the front, so speaker A, this is left and right. So I'm going to plug the red and the black, but remember, I'm just going to put it in, it just only goes in a little bit, just a tiny bit, it doesn't even cover all the way, don't, I've had people jam this and push this all the way through, they push so hard. So just put it in there, very, very easy, and that's it. Sometimes you can loosen or tighten these up, but I think, you know, they come pretty standard, it's fine. Um, They'll hang in there unless you have somebody wrapping, you know, pulling it out, but it'll, it'll stay in there pretty nicely. Okay, next up, uh, let's hook up. Um, maybe you received the one that has the quarter. If they have, if it's without LEDs, it'll have this panel, will send you a, a quarter inch cable like this. Then you don't have to use this because this one has the quarter inch extra adapter jack. So now I could just go quarter inch in the back of here and I'll plug in my other side, uh, which is. Uh, red and black, and I didn't jam it in there. I just put it in just a little bit. I just you can still see this is still showing, so you don't have to jam it in there. Okay, it's very easy. Now uh, we have both speakers hooked up. If you want to plug in uh, two more sets, you can, but then you would have to select A B on the front of the unit. If you bought four speakers from us, you'd use A B input on the front. 
maybe you purchased our Audio 2000 or our RSQ home style looking speakers. Very good. It's also used for commercial use, but um, these are a little different style. Uh, I'll show you how to hook up these. These sometimes come with a different cable, maybe have a, a, a different banana clip, which is no big deal. You just put the white, uh, the white into the red side and the black into the black, and that pushes in there and it'll, it'll stop automatically. And then you just take these two terminals, we solder these on there for you, and you just push in the red here and black here, and now your audio is all hooked up, okay? Now, let's move on to hooking up the TV. In this case, our TVs, if you purchase a TV from us, uh, some of them we give you, we can give you all three inputs uh, option. But you also have that same thing. You can use any three inputs for your video monitor. I'm going to go over each one. It's very simple. The first one I'm going to show you is VGA. This is a VGA cable. It's the blue. It looks like a printer cable. Okay, this goes into the VGA hookup on the back of the karaoke player. Now we're up top to the player. Okay, that's VGA. Okay, and I'll show you in a second how to select it on the TV. But let me just show you all three connectors. This is one option. Okay, you might want to use HDMI for your video. Here's option two. Goes into the HDMI. Okay, plug that in there. Option three. So HDMI. Option three would be the standard old RCA hookup, which is yellow. Okay? And that goes into your RCA. So you can use any three of those for your TV. It depends on your TV at home or which one you purchase from us. So I just showed you all three connections. Now, on the bottom of this, about my monitor, has the yellow hookup that I just showed you and it cooks into a green. This is the new style TVs, have a green. It'll say video Y for yellow, because it is a yellow, but it's, they make them green now, I don't know why, but the old TVs all have yellow, just like the back of there, so it's either gonna go into the yellow or the green hookup, very simple. And it would say video one, two, three, or four, five. Whatever one you select on here, you must go to this and your TV, and you hit input, okay on the TV and then hit channel down okay so input channel down to AV component once you get to AV component you wait a second and we should have the AV it says AV here in the corner and now the karaoke is bouncing around and if I hit play on the unit um, I should have a karaoke song play and here you go RSQ so I'm hooked up Okay, that's for the video. Now, if I use the HDMI, for instance, I'll plug the HDMI, I'll take the RCA out, plug the HDMI in now. So there's the HDMI, and the HDMI on this TV is on the side. HDMI, right here on the side. And then I would have to go back to the input selection on here, channel down to HDMI 2. Remember, make sure you check if you're on HDMI 2 or HDMI 1, because that will affect it, okay? And, and that'll also bring the audio through your TV. If you didn't have a system, you can use that. Now, I can just turn the volume down on this. Um, I'm gonna disconnect this now. And finally, the, um, once again, the VGA hookup was the first one I showed you, and then the VGA hookup is the blue one, and the blue one, once again, goes into the VGA hookup, the very first one I showed you. And I'll just unplug that. Once again, go to my input, scroll down, sometimes you have to hit that twice, to VGA, wait a second, and it'll pop up. This is a very easy uh, hookup. If you watch this video and you want to buy a system from me, mention this video, you watched it, 
and I'll give you 50% off your first music package you purchase from me. My name is Chuck Polidori, and I'm from Lightyear Music, and we have an outstanding technical staff standing by. If you purchase a system from us, we will assist you all the way through. You have unlimited phone tech support from us. I know I made this look pretty easy because I've been doing it for 25 years, but we have a great staff that will assist you and talk about some other features for you. And thank you again for watching. Have a nice day.